Hello everyone! For today's science activity we are going to be making a bird feeder out of a milk bottle. There are lots of birds that are common to gardens and parks and this will helpfully let you spot them. Now you may need an adult to help you with this. So the first thing we're going to do is cut two holes in two sides of our milk bottle. So I'll get the scissors and start. Cutting a hole on one side and a hole. So I'm cutting holes on two sides that are next to each other, just like in my example here. And I'm rounding them off so that there are no sharp corners that could hurt any birds. Okay, so the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take one of the skewers and I'm going to make two holes at the top to put the string through so that we can hang it up. So there's one. There's two. Now you may want to get your scissors and make the holes a bit bigger so that it's easier for you to put the string through. So I'm going to now get some string and I'm going to thread it through both holes. And so then I'm going to cut off a length, put the cut back on, and then I can tie it at the top. So that will let you hang up your bird feeder. Then the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to push one skewer through this way and the other skewer through this way so that the birds will have something to perch on. You see how I've got the skewers here? So I'll do that now. So you push them all the way through the bottle one going one way and one going the other way. So be careful with the skewers because they are pointy and you don't want to hurt yourself. When you've got them through the bottle you may want to cut the ends off so that you don't have the pointy ends anymore. And that's your basic bird feeder. So now if you want to decorate it, 
you can do if you've got some nice colouring pens or maybe some paints you might want to decorate your bird feeder and then all you need to do is add some bird seed like I've done in this one you see there's some bird seed inside and then that's ready to hang up now if you go to the Surrey Library Lab blog then there's a bird watching sheet that you can download to help you spot some common garden birds that you can see possibly in your gardens or in parks when you go out. So I hope you have some fun making your bird feeder. We would love to see some pictures that you make. So why don't you share with us them with us on Facebook or Twitter and we'll see you again soon. Goodbye!